Now we at Palat Lu, one of the most famous street food in Bangkok. สำหรับคำบรรยายภาษาไทยเปิดได้ที่ปุ่มนี้เลยค่ะ If you are a big fan of local street food in Thailand, you have to watch this video because now we at Palat Lu, one of the most famous street food in Bangkok. Let's go! The Yawarat Food Tour is already well known among tourists, but Tala Plu has long been a beloved market for local foodies, especially Thonburi people or Thonburians. Let me talk about a little bit fun fact. Bangkok that you know is actually consists of two sides. First one is Pranakorn, the newer site with all the fancy stuff. Another one is Thonburi, the old capital city and the real old town. I live in this area since I was born, and I come here so many many times. So today, I will show you as a local Thai friend. Let me show you which food that worth to try. If you come with BTS, you just drop at the Lapur station or Ponymit station and take the water by taxi. Tell them to drop you at the Lapur market. This is the old Thai desert shop. They sell the desert here more than 80 years, and my grandma always bought it home. If you want to try the authentic Thai sweet taste, please come to this place. In this area, in the noon time, the shop always will open around 11 o'clock. If you come around, if you come around here in the night time, it's gonna be like the night market. This is one of the most ancient desert in. The La Blue area. Okay, let's try. This is Kanung Sai Sai, but I don't know how to call it in English. Uh, okay, let's try though. Then this one is layer cake. If you want just one, just buy one. And it's content in banana leaf, I guess. And the correct way to eat the layer cake is you just need to Grab it layer by layer and eat it. Right. It's nice. Okay, and this one is sweet egg floss. Sweet egg floss. It's one of my favorite desserts. Talapu is well known about Gui Shai or Shai dumplings. If you come to Talapu, you're gonna see lots of stalls that sell Gui Shai. And this is my favorite store. They have two types of them, which are ceramic Shai and the fried Shai dumplings. Alright, now we got vegetable dumpling. And now I ordered the, um, the filling, the Chinese like juice. And it's contained with a tiny shrimp and the regular one. Let's go for it. I think vegetable dumpling is very pretty amazing if you eat with the sauce that I think it's jikcho and uh, waiga. Mm, it's amazing. This is an old school coffee shop of Talat Plu. They opened their first branch since 1918. The cafe is located under the bridge and you can obviously see the sign, right? There are many classic drink menus like Oliang or Thai Thai black coffee, iced pink milk, iced chocolate and soda drinks. And my favorite one, original Surya coffee. This is a taste of original Thai coffee, guys. Yep, we literally drink it from plastic bag. Sarin tip, Thai crispy pancake or Khanom Bueng 
I usually first top it or fill it with coconut cream, followed by the sweet or savory topping like shredded coconut, strip of fried eggs or egg yolks or chopped scallions. Great combination, huh? And I would say this chop always have the cue of local ties. Okay, we got it now. Freeze your cake ice cream. Um, I mean, for an egg ice cream. Actually, I have my favorite ice cream shop. It's called Niang, but today it's closed. It's closed. So I come to this store in states. It's called Mueli Ice Cream Thai Kang. Okay, let's try. Interesting. If you don't want to miss the food, I recommend you to come late in afternoon around 4 or 5 p.m. because some of the famous stores so are really fast. If you see a queue of locals in front of any store, that is a sign for you to try the famous local foods. But if you come after the sunset, you will experience the Lapurna market that's surrounded by lots of people and diversity of street foods. Malapu has many amazing food that are waiting for you to explore by yourself. And these are the 5 street foods that I recommend you to try. This is Free with Thai. If you like our content, don't forget to like and subscribe to Yakkyu And what we will gonna review on the next video, please stay tuned. Bye!